just an outright showstopper. Maybe the most important vintage card produced over a 25-year span. The Nolan Ryan rookie is, in our opinion, the, the quintessential rookie card from the 1960s. And offered here is an example that is absolutely earth-shattering. Uh, this has about the best color and print uh, as you will ever see on the issue. Absolutely vibrant, gorgeous in how it displays. The centering is near perfect, maybe five point centering shift uh, in this direction, but otherwise just beautifully framed right to left. You see the card kind of has it, is meant to be held. I mean, just beautifully framed right to left. And you know, the aesthetics being off center, top to bottom just a bit, it doesn't really show because the top border obviously isn't there. So, I mean, it looks almost like a dead centered card. Absolutely, you know, bright and oftentimes we're looking at this, um, you know, this uh, team issue area and this is about as well printed as you're ever going to see in them. There's almost no flaws to speak of. It's bright and bold. It's hard to tell in this, you know, video, but this is a really bold coloring uh, to this example. Corners are absolutely sharp. This is just a whisker from a nine. In fact, if it had it created a nine, I don't think anybody would question it. Uh, for us, it's a whisker away from our IPL designation. Uh, about the only thing holding it back, maybe just a, a, a bit more of a centering shift on the back than you typically see. A very minor focus shift, as you can see in the hat. Just a micro couple da print dots in the centering shift, but it's like it's it's a it's a great eight and a half. I mean, I, I really don't think anybody would question it had it graded a nine. I think uh, it could easily be reviewed for a higher grade even. So just all throughout, I mean, you can see how packed fresh it is, and again, just Nolan Ryan incomparable critical figure uh, from the vintage space and the guy retired in the 90s <laughs> so you got four different decades this guy played uh, that's a pretty cool card and about as good a brand as it gets